Team I Sublime. Be Sublime, I Sublime. Hey guys, it's Team I Sublime and Yucateco here. Um, I'm just doing this so I can show you guys some of my concept tips and stuff like that. And as you guys can see, I got my braces, so just bear with me. I might not be able to talk that well. So let's get on with it. Okay, so my way of kind of making up new concepts, I know there are a lot of people who sit there and kind of wonder like, oh, my new show's coming up, I have to do a new concept, all that kind of stuff. There's usually like no place you can really start. So what I like to do, I just like to do, I pick one random position and I go one move at a time and then two moves, three moves, four moves. And from there, I usually pick up a new concept. So I'm gonna try just a random move. Or we could start here. And so what I want to do from here, maybe branch it out like that. Um, we could probably bring this down like that maybe. And then come back down. Yeah, that works. Okay. And then from here I choose two, so one, two. That's my second step of the concept. And then probably, where can I go from here? Back up, out, turn around, out, maybe. Okay, from here I could probably go different position you could say. So from here that's where I start a completely new concept so I can connect both of them. So then I can go probably like that, connect them back, out, back to start. And from here you could probably do a, co a couple different new moves. So yeah, that's basically how I come up with my concepts. I start with one move and then I keep going up each move. So we could do, we could probably do a different one right now. So let's start with, um, probably do, let's just do this for now. One, two, three. Usually when I get to this a different position I start a completely different trend. So you go let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. See how my angles are always intact on each I try to keep it that way to not get lazy with them, I guess. Because I know a lot of times we get lazy in shows and don't do the right angles that we're supposed to. Um, another thing, I always tend to go back to my old moves. Like right now, I kind of wanted to do that, but that would be pretty boring. I'm trying to think of something else I could do. I should probably do... Eight...
from there I just start making up random stuff. I'm trying to think of any other kind of um, any other situation you'd probably be in. Like if you're like in a flail and you want to go back to back to a new move, I guess you could probably do oh, something like that, and then you could go to like. I need to work on my King Tut that's for sure, because I'm very close-minded when it comes to King Tut. I, I would do the same thing over and over, so I was practicing one that kind of goes like this. I don't know if you guys can see it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is a really bad angle, I know, but eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and then I go back to my original. I've done that part before. I think I got too high on that part, so I'll probably just redo it. I think that's pretty much how I make up my concepts. I know everyone else in the team makes, has a different process. I usually like starting, like I said before, I go one, then two, then three, then four. And then I usually just branch out from there, connect old ones. But I have trouble sometimes connecting my older ones because I forget them at times. But um, yeah, I'm pretty sure. That's about it. That's how I do my concepts. If you guys have a different way, you can probably comment it if you want to. Like, subscribe. Honestly, I don't care what you guys do. <laughs> just hope you like this video. Hope it could help. And just one last tip before we leave. I, I think the key to doing, to learning new concepts is just feel the music. Just think of a song you want to do before. And kind of go with the music with according to the song like musicality is my number one thing um, I try to incorporate that into a lot of my shows so I think if you use the song how you want to I think you'll really just open up your mind and you don't even have to think about it once you're through that barrier of your gloving experience I think I think it's a lot easier after a certain point where you don't even have to think about it anymore you can just use the song according to your moves. Like for example, what was it? Um, I'm trying to think of the song name. It's Latch by Disclosure, my recent show. I made up most of those concepts on the spot just because I'm so in tune with the music. I feel like whatever comes out, I don't even, it doesn't even matter if it looks good or not. As long as you like how it feels at the moment, that's all that really matters. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys later.